Hey everybody, it's Ivy, and today I'm gonna be showing you guys how I got this super cute color. And if you guys can believe it, it was a total mistake. So let's get right into the video. Okay, you guys, so let's get right into the details of this hair. Um, this hair is from Sunbur Hair. So this is the box that your unit will come in. So inside we have this beautiful unit. And as you guys can see, Yes, it's a colorful unit. So your wig comes packaged really nice. This is a really pretty color. This is the parting space. You don't get a whole, 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 whole lot of parting space, but you get a nice amount, okay? You get a nice amount, and this is what the unit looks like. Just your traditional standard unit. Right here at the back, it does have uh, adjustable bands and a comb. And um, yeah, you guys, this is the unit. This is the color. I think this color is so gorgeous, but I am gonna transform this. Before I transform the wig, I'm gonna try it on so you guys can see it. Guys, I'm really thinking about taking this color of this unit to something else. I just don't know what color I, I really wanna do. Um, I think I'm gonna lighten it more and then put a rinse on it. I'm not sure, what do you guys think? What I decided to do was a bleach water bath and all you need is your regular bleach and I'm using 40 volume developer and I did about three scoops of bleach and I just poured developer until it was this nice like creamy consistency as you guys can see. So you just want to pour that into a separate bowl and then you want to add water and then you just want to mix that up really well make sure it's nice and combined. Now I'm gonna go ahead and add in my wig and I let this um, process for about 25 minutes. Um, make sure it's really saturated throughout all of the hair. This lifted the hair like about one to two levels. Um, it didn't get too, too bright, but it lifted bright enough so I could um, go in and color it the color that I wanted. But if you would like your hair lighter, definitely let it process for um, a longer amount of time. So to color the hair, I'm gonna also do a water bath and I'm using the Kiss Tentation Colors. I'm using Cyan, which is like a really pretty blue and I use the entire bottle of that. And then I just used a tiny bit of the um, blue black hair color. As you guys can see, I didn't use that much blue black because I didn't want my hair too dark and now I'm just gonna mix those colors together. And once that's combined, I just went in with my wig and this is how it looked. And you just want to um, place that into the water. And I did uh, do my watercolor bath while the hair was wet. And um, you guys, I came out with the weirdest color. Like this is not the color I was expecting. This color, um, it still came out really pretty. Um, but this color, I don't even, you guys, honestly, I don't know how to describe this color. To me, it just looks very oil slick like but then at the same time it gives you like this mermaidy type vibe are you guys getting the mermaid vibe like me or is it just me let me know in the comment section below what like what does this hair color look like i have no idea what to describe it as it was supposed to come out like blue and then like darker blue that's what i was going for but this was cute so um once i washed and conditioned it i just went ahead and put it on my mannequin head and then I um, diffused it. I didn't let this air dry because I wanted to um, just make sure those curls was popping. And I went in with my GDP Pro and I will link that below if you guys, you know, are interested in knowing where to get a good diffuser that isn't, you know, super expensive. I got this from Sally's by the way. And you guys look at the color when it was dry. Oh, it is so cute. It is the prettiest color. Like it's the prettiest mistake I've ever made. Like, I love the color so much. I was a little bit scared of how it would blend with my skin tone. But once I installed this, you guys, it was so cute. Like, it was definitely giving mermaid vibes. It's so, so pretty. It's like the perfect tone. It could match with any skin color. 
So first I'm just gonna go in and cut the lace from around the perimeter. And I am gonna um, be applying this with my um, EBN um, lace spray. I will link that below as well. I love this stuff. Like it literally, you guys, it holds so well. It's way better than got to be, way, way better. So you just wanna um, cut your lace off following your own natural hairline. And now I'm gonna start tacking this down. You just wanna spray that hairspray right to the area where you want your lace to lay. And I'm, ha I'm having a little trouble. Okay, there I go. So you just wanna spray it down, not too much. You guys, please be light-handed with this product. So um, after you spray it, you just lay your lace down. And then I'm gonna use my dryer on medium heat. And I'm basically just drying down the product. And that is what's gonna help the lace like stay in place. Like this spray is bulletproof, you guys. It's really good. If you haven't tried it, definitely give it a try. And um, the lace melted down really well. Um, I believe this is a HD lace. If it's not HD, it's, it's pretty popping, but I believe it's HD lace. So now I'm just taking a few hairs out and I'm gonna um, do my baby hair. And as you guys know, I definitely like to mold my baby hair, as you can see I'm doing here, before I go in and actually cut it. So I'm just using a little bit of hair product and I'm just um, molding those into place. And then I'm gonna go in and cut. I'm gonna cut off the hair. And then once I cut the hair, I just go back in and I re-sculpt. I like doing it this way just so I can get my baby hairs to perfection. I don't like to cut until I know that's exactly what I want my baby hair to look like. So yeah, that's just my little method I like doing. This unit was super easy to install. And right here, I'm just gonna go in and cut the ends. I did cut it when it was on my mannequin head, but I don't know, I guess I didn't cut it good enough. So I'm just trimming off those loose ends because I do like my curly hair a little bit on the shorter side rather than super long. And you guys, this is like the end result. Like, I don't know who I think I am. It's just so cute, you guys. Like, honestly, what is this color called? I don't know, but this hair was lovely, you guys. This is definitely one of my units I'm keeping. Definitely gonna pull this back out, you know, if I'm going out or something. This is definitely like night on the town hair. If you wear this hair, you guys, everybody is gonna turn heads. Like everybody's gonna be complimenting your hair. Like the color is very eye catching, especially in real life. Okay, you guys, so this is the end result of the color. And I really like how it came out. It's really, um, like i don't really know how to explain this color since it it was a mistake like this is this isn't the initial color i wanted to do but i really like how it came out it looks gorgeous um i really like how i was able to just transform this unit into something totally new and different so cute and the hair feels really nice um i did this is the next day actually the hair does feel nice it's really nice and soft it's just, it's gorgeous, you guys. Um, no product in it. It's up for a little bit of conditioner, but it's super cute. I love it. Nice and soft, not tangling. The lace matches really good. I didn't have to um, do too much stuff to it. You can really play around with this unit. It gives you a lot of options. You can wear it the color it comes, and then later on, do like a whole new color on it. So um, yeah, you guys, it's gorgeous. Let me show you. The curls. I definitely feel like this is a like oil slick type of color. I don't. I can't explain, you guys. It's just it's so cute. So yeah, you guys. I want to thank you for watching another one of my videos. Everything I use from today's video will be linked below. Make sure you thumb this up and also subscribe. Make sure you comment and let me know if you like the color. If you want me to do more, you know, wacky. <laughs> different colors just let me know below and i will talk to you guys in the next video